Tobacco to talk on behalf of uh, this dance troupe. Uh, this dance troupe was, uh, has come together here uh, in Morongo. They uh, represent the Morongo people. And uh, it was a dance troupe, an idea at the beginning. It's the kids that are around here, they witnessed and came to this powwow many times. And, and uh, originally, the, the Morongo people are not uh, powwow people, but they liked what they saw and they wanted to be a part of it. And so eventually, the, the young people, the young kids, wanted to dance also. Like they saw the dances that, all these dances, they come from the middle of the United States in the Plains area. And a lot of us have initiations to come into this dance circle. So I was given a little bit of tobacco to speak on their behalf um, and say a little bit for them. My name is Richard D. Crane. I'm a United States Navy veteran. Um, I'm also a dancer. Uh, I come from uh, the state of Montana. I'm also Navajo and Crow. Um, and so I was given a little bit of tobacco to speak on their behalf. And this is a dance group that was formed here, a dance troupe. And today we're going to have their coming out ceremony. We asked uh, two, uh, Michelle Black Kettle and Audrey Oni, to give them a little bit of uh, teachings about what it means to be a powwow dancer, what it means to be to come into this uh, arena and be a part of this healing uh, circle. And so we had them come out, and we have uh, we talked to the drums. And they're going to be singing the, the honor song for them, for their initiation to coming out. And earlier today, we um, actually presented them. The family presented them. You're going to be... Go ahead and... And uh, earlier today, the family came together, and we got some of their feathers, and we were placed on the feathers on them. There's a few feathers that are still coming up that, uh, that are going to be put on, on their, their outfit or on their person. And this is uh, to initiate them also into this dance circle. These uh, feathers are very sacred to us as uh, dancers, as Native Americans, as individual people. It's a rite of passage for a lot of us. You know, you don't get this just like, you can't just get this every day. You know, it's like something that's earned and not just given in, in light. So today you're witnessing uh, coming out of these young ladies. Like I said, they, yeah, go ahead. They, they've been preparing this whole year, coming together in their little dance uh, circle, dance arena that they had. They formed the dance group and the families, and a lot of hard work was put into this little bit of a ceremony of coming out. A lot of families got together and put together outfits. Uh, things were taking time and put together. They weren't just bought at Walmart or something like that. There was, uh, it took time. Relatives passed on feathers, and one of the most sacred items that you can get is the eagle feather. And so today, they're going to be able to wear that honor of having it. And, and we're also calling all the fancy shawl dancers to come and dance with these young ladies. You know, they're going to be a part of this dance circle. And we asked, um, we asked Showtime to sing their honor song for them. So we're going to get them lined up. Uh, we're going to wait on handshakes. Sometimes people will try to come up and give handshakes, but we're going to wait on that. We're going to have the girls dance around by themselves together with uh, their mentors. And all of the fancy shawl, we're asking you to come out and dance with them. And then after they do one time around, they'll ask the family to join them in their honor song. So. Uh, yeah, you guys. Dance, yeah. Okay. So, girls, you're gonna be in front, and uh, so drum group. Whenever you're ready, show time.
Ladies and gentlemen, let's give them a round of applause. First time coming out dancing here at the Thunder and Lightning. Good God. Friends and family, go ahead and come out and join behind them. Go ahead and come out. Dancers also come out and join behind them, please. Now you can slow down a little bit, family. You don't have to race after them. 